It's always a, thr a thrill to present the best in any category, and today we have with us the best host in a game show on daytime TV, and the best daytime host or hostess from Hollywood Squares, Emmy Award winner, Peter Marshall. <laughs> I did this for Sly. Oh, I see. I always come out in that. Nice and nasty. Right, I always have the clothes and the jazz, and I figured I came down this way in the limo, and I had the nice suit and everything, and I saw Sly, and I said, hey, no, this is the way I go. And this is the way you dress at rehearsals? Yeah, tonight, sure. Because I've seen you on NBC that way. Hey, congratulations. Thank I'm you. winning. Thank you very much. It's I a good feeling, isn't it? Yeah. It really is. I don't know what I won. What do you mean you don't know what you won? I don't know what I won. The, the Emmys were so friends. confusing. A lot of friends. Oh, thank you, Sly. Yeah. I hope yeah. I've had those for some time. But, yeah. you know, there were so many different categories this year. And uh, you were up and I was up. And Dinah, I, I wound up against Dinah. And uh, we don't even do the same type show. And Are you proposing any changes for next year? I was, uh, when they said, let's have a daytime uh, Emmy Awards. Thing. I said, that's a great idea. And I went in to idea. the Academy. Doggone right. You know, we work hard as you work hard, and I, daytime does I believe work it. Hard too, man. That's right. <laughs> are you, it's are an amazing. You, are, are you going to talk to me? Uh, excuse me, Sly. <laughs> no, no, really. No, really. Uh, honest. I, I honest. certainly will, Sly. Are you going to talk to me? Uh, yes. What would you like to talk about? I don't know. Uh, I know that you love to be loved. <laughs> not by you. Uh, no, you? no. <laughs> believe me, Sly. I was not being Sly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, I was just, no, I, I he asked so there me about, you go again. no, <laughs> now watch this, no, 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 I'll do this whole schmear. Here, no, 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 uh, Michael, you were asking me about the other Proposing thing. any changes. Yes, well, we... Did uh, you hear about that? <laughs> He's going to propose some changes for the Emmy slide. A ping pong game. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, changes should be simpler, that's all. Just make the category simpler and hopefully... Hey, uh, go back uh, over there, man. I feel it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> No, now he's looking. This is better. Yeah, sure it is. This way. is my best side. Okay. You know, I have these huge teeth, you see, and this is a little better right here. <laughs> anyway, I hope it's simpler next year. And that's enough for the uh, NBA Awards, folks. Until next year, this is Peter Marshall saying good night. <laughs> is that right? I heard, you know, I watch the show, and you, you give away a, a trip to... Uh, uh, an area in Mexico that I'm not familiar with, and yet somebody said you just returned from there. Well, I, we just got back from Puerto Vallarta. There were 30 of us that went down. It was called the Hollywood Squares Junket, and it was wild. We, uh, there was Karen Valentine and David Hartman and uh, uh, Vinnie Price and Karen and all of us. We all went down. This we is got, worse. No, this is fun. This is fun. Listen to this story, Sly. We get on the plane, and there was Richard Burton. <laughs> You know, it really, it, this is worse. Hey, Sly, will you... Hey, wait! Excuse me, will you look at me once in a while, Sly? <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, please. Anyway, we get on the plane, I'm and there, sorry. there's Richard Burton. You know Richard Burton? Yeah. Right. And uh, he's on the plane. Yeah. yeah. I know Richard Burton. Big guy. Yeah. Big in the biz guy. Yeah. And uh, he's there, and he has nine seats all alone, right? Nine seats. Nine seats to himself. For what? I don't know. He didn't want to be bothered, but he had the first seat. So now you get on the plane and you have to pass Richard Burton, right? There he, there he is. He takes a shine to, excuse the expression, uh, to... Uh, <laughs> That's terrible. I apologize. That's tacky. That's really tacky. I apologize. No, but he takes a liking. How about that? A liking to, uh, uh, to Karen Valentine. Oh, yes, he was. Richard Burton. I'm going to get you. <laughs> <laughs> you know that, don't you? You want, you want me to go back there? And <laughs> oh, let me stay there. <laughs> I thought it was going to say Blade. <laughs> <laughs> no, he really takes a liking to Karen Valentine. And she's there with her boyfriend, Johnny Hager, the Hager twins. Oh, yeah, I know. John. And so he's going to have a cocktail party. And it was going to be for eight people. And it wound up, all, all of us were invited. And now we're at this party, and he's mad for Karen Valentine. And he keeps saying, now remember the scene. You realize we're getting a scoop? This is a scoop. Yeah, it's Call really true. No, it really is true. Yeah. I mean, it, I, I was there. And uh, <laughs> she's mad for Johnny Hager. I mean, and Johnny Hager, I don't know if you know the Hager twins from Hee Haw. He's about as real as you can get. That's I right. mean, he's just Great. real. 
And uh, Bert would say things like, Karen, uh, tonight you're with me. You're my girlfriend. And Johnny's sitting there. He said, no, no, you don't understand, rich baby. Uh, <laughs> rich baby. And she'd go, rich baby, watch him. She, she's everybody's girl, but she's with me. And this kept going all oh, night. He kept funny. going zap, zap, and Hager would go zappity do. It was wonderful to watch. It really I was. can't imagine that combination of Karen ba Valentine and Richard and Burton, Richard Burton is mind-boggling enough. But <laughs> Karen Valent, but Richard Burton and and uh, the one of the Hager twins. I can't from imagine him home. referring to me as Shine. <laughs> 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 I know. I know. I'll tell you one thing, you're not nervous right now. No, I, I, <laughs> I heard something I can't believe, Peter. You've got a successful show, you've just won an Emmy, two Emmys, and you're going to go to that jungle. You're going to go and play Las Vegas. Yeah, go to the jungle. He uh, really is. <laughs>